Mangrove forests can be a great agent when it comes to combating climate change thanks to their ability to capture large amounts of carbon, but human encroachment has had a severe impact on mangroves across the world. In Kenya, however, this seems to be changing. Our next report telling you how. Mangrove forests are an important part of Kenya's ecology. They are a key component in fighting climate change. This is because coastal ecosystems store more carbon than terrestrial forests. They capture carbon which are then referred to as blue carbon. However, they are under constant threat due to factors such as logging, fish farming, coastal development and pollution. In a positive development, local communities in Kenya are fighting back in order to restore these plants in their natural habitat. The group is called Mikiko Pamoja, which is Swahili for mangrove together. The group has been planting seedlings to protect the area from coastal erosion, loss of fish and climate change. The community has been able to plant around 4,000 trees on an annual basis. They have also received technical support from Marine and Research Institute in Kenya. If the army can stay here, thank God, we will stay with our children here. If not, however, if we are Malians, let them give us at least a week to move out of here. That's all we ask. The mangrove forest is thriving and the air has become cleaner for the villages that are closer to the forests. This is one of the benefits that we are experiencing. The mangrove forests also provide a breeding ground for fish and for the past 10 years, we have noticed an increase in the number of fish unlike in the previous years. Protecting mangroves earn them carbon credits which can be traded. Carbon credits are awarded for each ton of greenhouse gas emissions removed from the atmosphere. So far, the community members have earned over $25,000 this year. Other than helping the environment, this money also helps the community improve their living standards. This year we have been able to raise about 3 million Kenya shillings whereby this 3 million is divided into five uh, groups, whereby the first uh, thing we do is we divide this money into five groups, whereby 36% goes for mangrove restoration, 32% is for community development projects, 5% goes for office expenses, and 21% goes for community wages, whereby 6% is used by our brokers to do the marketing. The group began its operations in 2013 and currently manage 290 acres of mangroves in Ghazi Bay. The community can sell around 3,000 tons of carbon credits each year for the next 20 years. The benefits also go further than just carbon credits. As the community now has easy access to clean water. Kenya's mangrove cover dropped from 60,000 hectares in 2017 to around 53,000 hectares in 2021. However, the habitat is recovering through government and community support. Currently, mangroves account for 10% of Kenya's total forest cover. Bureau Report, Vion, World is One. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.